What's up, you guys? It is your boy JJ back with another video. Welcome to the Ryan Marketing Podcast, episode 24. Boom, boom, boom. You guys, I'm super excited. Well, I'm happy because you guys make me happy and you guys love listening to my voice, which makes me super excited and I'm a talkative person. But other than that, you guys, you know what the title of the story is today. Did you hear what happened to Facebook and what's next? Boom. So, you guys, you know that Facebook's removing partners' categories and. <laughs> You're probably thinking, what are we going to do? Or you're probably thinking, what is partners categories, right? Partners categories, pretty much, if you're on the ad set settings on Facebook, if you're an advertiser, you know this. If you're Mortgage Pro, that's advertising. You should know this. But it's a, it's a if, let's say, you're clicking on a demographic or behavior uh, targeting that says, like, a likely to move, if you hover over that, on that side, on the right side, a little box will hover and it'll say partners categories. That is third data. That happened because of Cambridge Analytica's scandal. Zucky was on the Hill talking about that. And he was talking about making some major fame changes on Facebook. So the question is, OMG, if they're going to get rid of those third-party categories, which I absolutely love. I never used any interest tar- Well, I did. Very little. But my go-to was demographic and behavior targeting. That's where we got the most quality leads from. question is now, what are we going to do? And how are you going to get consistent quality leads? But before you say Facebook sucks, you guys, honestly, step back for a second. If you want to live, you got to adapt or you're going to die, unfortunately. Everything right now is digital. Show me a platform right now that's just as good as Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, or YouTube, or Google Ads, or SEO, uh, or, or just Google itself, like SEO. Nobody. Radio ads don't work. TV ads don't work. Magazine doesn't work. The Chamber and BNI Commerce doesn't work for most of y'all. So don't worry. I got the answers for you. Let's talk business. All right, so you guys, I've been preaching about this for since like day one. You guys, ad copy, ad copy, ad copy, ad copy, ad copy is the way where you're gonna get those consistent quality leads on demand. And I specifically now am talking about all the time story ads. In addition to that, to get more quality leads, you guys should be using video views campaigns. I was running an ad for someone last week and we were running a Facebook lead ad. Jesus, slipping slippy. I'm a sore, but my gut, go- my golly, it was like $150 per CPM. So per 1,000 people, you had to pay about, you have to have like a daily budget of $150. It was too expensive. Of course, like my copy's good. He still got quality leads out of that. But the problem is it was just too darn expensive. So we had switched them over to a video views campaign. You guys, that went from $150 to like 15 bucks per day. And he reached like 5,000 people per day. It was ridiculously amazing. And it's great for brand awareness, and it's easy to retarget because you can retarget by video views and you just continue, continue, continue. Anyways, if you guys want a video on that, I think I already have a video on that. Uh, just go ahead, check our check around our podcast or whatever it is, and you'll find it somewhere, somehow, some way. I don't know. Other than that, you guys, also the second, the third thing I would recommend to you as well, not only to improve your ad copy, not only to switch over to video view campaigns, but stop tra- stop using you know just traffic campaigns. Try conversion campaigns. That's really good as well because you can track the lead. And after 50 leads, after the opt-in, Facebook will know who to show their ads to. That's a really good campaign as well, which not only lowers your cost per acquisition, it also lowers your cost per lead, but also lowers your cost per acquisition as well because you'll know who's ready to opt-in. Also, you guys, start using Facebook lead ads, but with a twist, ask questions on that Facebook lead ad. Don't just ask for the name, number, and email. Too many mortgage pros are doing this and they're not getting the quality lead that they're looking for. So ask them questions like, are you a first time home buyer? If you're targeting FHAs, if you're targeting um, sellers, target people who are divorced, are you divorced? Yes or no? Single, married, divorced? Have them answer those questions and other questions as well so that way you can get the most quality lead, okay? It's not quantity. I always preach quality and ROI with my clients. So if you're working with us, you don't have to worry about that, but the people who aren't, You got a lot to worry about. I'm just kidding. I'm here to help you out, right? So make sure that you're doing that correctly. Also, another thing, I think I gave you four things so far. Number five, use LPV campaigns, landing page view campaigns. Those campaigns are really good because Facebook will find the people who are likely to click on your call to action button and get onto your landing page. And then when they're on the landing page, they're probably going to fill out your information and then opt in. And then you could use that as a conversion campaign as well. There's so many tricks and hacks I can give you guys, obviously. But if I give everything today, we'd be here for a couple of hours. And we don't want to be here for a couple hours because it is Sunday. And I know you guys want to have a good time. So, you guys, don't worry about it. All right? Like I said, there's no other 
marketing or type of you know platform out there like social media right now that's going to get you the quality leads that you want because guess what all your consumers are on here <laughs> if you guys are listening to this you can't see the faces i'm making but if you're watching me on youtube you can see all the faces i'm making other than that you guys if you have any questions and you want to know more stuff or other you know if you have questions or need help you guys go over to my website UriahMarketing.com, I, JJ, will be you, build you a custom marketing blueprint plan for free. There'll be no selling on this call. I'll help you build a campaign from point A to point Z. All right, and back. All right, we'll even go back and re-talk about it if you want to make sure. For free, none of that. If you obviously want to work with us, <laughs> well, you know you have to pay to play. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but that, you guys, I love you all. Peace, love, and chicken grease. There's one more thing I was going to show you guys. Oh, yes. Don't forget. Subscribe. You see that button right there? Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click that notification button as well. You're going to see all my YouTube videos. And don't forget, follow us on SoundCloud. Follow us on iTunes. Soon to be TuneIn Radios. So we'll get on that. And follow us on our Instagram. Follow that. Follow, hit that follow button. And like us on Facebook. But that, you guys, peace, love, and chicken grease. Uh, see you later.